Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do the daily vibes for around the 7th. Okay? Uh, things may not go as planned today, so keep that in mind. There could be some interruptions. Anyhow, interruptions of the plans, you know. Uh, some sort of change, a need to change the plans. What I see is 555. 555 five, 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 is expect the unexpected. Okay? There could be a change to the plans. All of a sudden. Okay? And I saw it say all of a sudden because I just saw the Ace of Wands, which is all of a sudden. Um, yeah, so let's get started. Timing is fluid on these readings and not every reading is for you these just fell out so we have to take them wow nine of wands reversed and the four of cups reversed now the nine of wands reversed is a challenge uh hard feelings somebody may be angry they may have some hard feelings they're uh, refusing to compromise this is a setback Okay, this is somebody taking an opportunity. They've been ignoring the opportunity, but now they're taking it. We have somebody here that has been sulking. This person has been pouting, crying, um, self-loathing, really discontent. Uh, and now I feel like they're angry. They, you know, it's kind of like the grieving process, you know. They go from sadness to anger. <laughs> So that's what it looks like to me. So I think we're at this, we got somebody here that's upset and they're, it's interesting because I was going to start this reading out with reacting out of their pain. Somebody's reacting out of their pain and I'm seeing it in my comments, you know, under the videos. I'm working on my new moon videos, my new moon readings and I've only got like, I think four left to do. Um, maybe three. Yeah, I think I only got three. Yeah, three left to do. Anyhow, in the comments in particular, I see that, and it feels like it's mostly fire signs. I'm going to be honest with you, okay? Because that's who I am. Are reacting from their pain. They're reacting from their pain and commenting on their ex's signs. You know, they're going in and they're commenting with hate. Or they're creating new accounts and they're commenting you know what I mean? And and I'm very observant, so I, I can I see exactly what's going on. They're reacting from their pain and it's not just fire signs, but this is would be a fire sign. Could be a water sign, could be anybody. Anyhow, somebody people are reacting from their pain and um that's what's exactly what is going on. So um be prepared for that. You know, the pain that people are harboring inside, resent resent and that's exactly this is hard feelings okay that is hard feelings and reversed okay somebody is is reacting in anger because of a, of, of a loss okay a lot that is a loss okay this is grief their grief is causing a reaction and so you may be on the other end you know they don't even realize you may be just be the you're not even the target of their pain, but you're getting the payout. Do you know what I'm saying? And that happens a lot. Who do people hurt? The person they love the most. That's a fact. Okay? So that's what we got here. Now, now, not only that, I mean, what people are, like, for example, I'm just going to use this for an example. I just, I just, we just had a Leo that commented on the Virgo reading. And I deleted it because she was bashing the Virgo. I deleted it immediately. So what she did was went underneath a Virgo's comment and rewrote everything she wrote because she had to do it. She had to get it out. She didn't care if she hurt that Virgo as long as she was getting out her pain. That is what is about to happen here. That is what's happening in the next day. It doesn't matter who I hurt as long as I express my pain. She's blocked now. Don't bother trying to comment. 
and then she want to be secretive and create another account, which a lot of people have been doing lately. They got to get their comments out there. It's happening on social media. People just cannot keep their mouth shut. So anyway, it's going to be an extremely challenging time for those people that can't. Because they are going to get a reaction. But it's going to be a negative reaction. People are going to push them away. People are going to ridicule them. They're going to get attacked. When they could have just kept their mouth shut. Two of Wands. Two of Wands is about a choice. It's about a decision. Being at a crossroads. Do you want to stay or do you want to go? What's your next step? Needing to take a step. Spur the moment decision. Up or down. So be prepared to make a spur of the moment decision. Ace of Pentacles reverse. And the Ace of Pentacles reverse is a lost opportunity. No unplanned. Unplanned. Things are not going to go as planned. They're not. I know that they're not. This is some sort of. It's a big loss. I mean, the Ace of Pentacles reverse is a huge loss of stability. Could be a loss of a job. Could be loss of a home. Something you can touch. Something is being taken away. You didn't plan on it being taken away. Or it's being given away. Or it's a loss in some way. Lost opportunity. Missed opportunity. Unplanned. Somebody did not plan effectively. They didn't plan for this challenge. Because it's definitely going to be a challenge with that Nine of Wands. This is a loss of stability. A loss of security. Unrealistic. Now, the Nine of Wands reversed is bad luck. Somebody that wants their own way, that is very disagreeable, that has a lot of pride, that is overwhelmed, that has a chip on their shoulder, that refuses to compromise, refuses to just let things go. Somebody is refusing to let something go. They're making a choice. But I feel like this choice, they're choosing to act on their emotions. And this is emotions. It really is. Over, what the heck? Seven of Pentacles reversed. Definitely being unrealistic, not practical, dissatisfied. Somebody is dissatisfied with an outcome. And it's like they're taking an opportunity to... Uh, fight. It's, this is like a fight of some sort. It's a, I don't know, Nine of Wands reversed. This is uh, overwhelmed. Definitely overwhelmed. We have somebody here that is angry. Very angry about what life has thrown at them. Five of Cups reversed. Let's get another one. Ten of Swords reverse may or may not survive. Somebody may not survive. They may or may not survive. This is going as low as you can go. Somebody may stoop very, 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 very low. They're sad. They're grieving. Somebody is grieving over a loss. They are definitely grieving. Okay, this is grieving over a loss. I just, I just said it. Okay, um, and they're in pain. They are suffering. Somebody is pain. It feels like there's, there's, there's like a, it almost feels like they can't, somebody could, uh, you know, you know, this person is on the ground and this, so I feel like somebody could hit the ground, you know, I'm sorry to say that. Um, there's some sort of prolonged grief here with the five of cups, with the five of cups reversed.
somebody needs to let bygones be bygones, but they've been in a deep dep depression. It's time to focus on the future. I feel like somebody is grieving over a loss and they're thinking about, because they get, they're about to make a decision. Somebody may want a reunion. They may be coming back to apologize even. So that's, I don't know who that is for. There could be somebody that hurt another person very, very badly that is coming to apologize. I mean, that, you could be hearing, I'm sorry. Okay, you could be hearing those words. Somebody is definitely making a decision to take an opportunity uh, to focus on the future, which is a good thing. So I don't know who that is for. We do have somebody that has probably stooped very low. They probably have done something to hurt another person very, very badly. They may be apologizing. Somebody may be apologizing. I'm just going to be honest here. Somebody may, that may be for some of you. I also feel... Um, with a Ten of Swords reversed. I mean, that's a breakdown. It's a near-death experience. Um, there's there, Things could be getting worse. Somebody could be in some extreme pain with the Ten of Swords. That's an extreme. It reverses our extremes or the absence of something. But this is freedom, okay? There is some sort of liberation here, being freed from a situation. There, there's, a, there's an opportunity to be freed from anger, but somebody has been choosing to live in an angry state of mind. I can see the anger. That stems from prolonged grief. Anyhow, we do have a big, huge loss here. Somebody lost something valuable to them. And that's why they've been grieving so hard. But there is an opportunity. I mean, there could be a reunion here as well. I mean, I think I already said that. I'm not sure, but Five of Cups could be somebody coming back. Somebody coming back from the dead, because Ten of Swords could be a death. Okay. Um, this person decides that they want to let bygones be bygones. Maybe they decide that they've been unrealistic. They may be even asking for forgiveness. And I don't see that very often. So, anyhow. I also feel like... Um, there's, there's some sort of uh, dead end. Okay, it's a dead end. Somebody thought the grass was greener on the other side and it didn't work out. And that could be why they are coming back. We also could have somebody here that has some chronic health problems, okay, with that Ten of Swords reversed. This person is growing weaker with a Nine of connected to this, okay? We could have somebody that has some chronic health problems and they're getting sicker, they're getting weaker. They didn't take care of themselves when they should have. You know, they didn't nurture themselves, they didn't take care of themselves. So there could be sadness over a loss. I mean, this person may not make it. I mean, I'm just being honest with you. Somebody may not wait, make it because they didn't take care of them. This is not watering, not taking care of situation. So if somebody didn't take care of themselves, you know, <laughs> you, you, you don't survive. I mean, we get, the, we get the Page of Wands in reversed, or it's the Knight of Wands in reversed. This is, this is bad news, okay? It could be a sudden departure. 
there is definitely somebody that has a chip on their shoulder here in this reading as well. This person is angry. They have a chip on their shoulder. They're very egotistical. It feels like they're doing something reckless. It feels like there's reckless behavior here. Or they did something reckless. Forgiveness is needed. Forgiveness is needed here. This is forgive and release. This is liberation. This is freedom. It's, there's an opportunity to break free from this suffering, but forgiveness is needed. Everything happens for a reason. Anyway, somebody is going to be reacting. They're going to be acting on... The, it's going to be a day of acting on emotions and anger. That's what I see. I feel like we have somebody here that can't control themselves. This is somebody who is loud, obnoxious, boastful. Doesn't want to accept responsibility. This is somebody that is a show-off. Angry. I think we have somebody that is acting, you know, they're, they're acting out their emotions and they're angry. <laughs> they are angry. So I feel like... Uh, There is something, it's worse. It's problems getting worse. Somebody's, somebody, they're grieving, pro, that's what it is. Somebody's grieving has went to the next stage, which is anger. And they're in that stage of anger and they're reacting out of their anger. And it feels like they're going to do something stupid. This is something stupid without thinking. And, you know, they may not survive, so I don't know. This is may or may not survive. And this is sad. It's very sad. But it's a choice that somebody makes. Somebody, this is, this is a choice, okay, the two, of, the two of wands. Somebody is making a choice to do something. The choice will determine the outcome. So somebody is making a choice and it's almost like they shouldn't invest. They shouldn't. They should just give up. They should stop focusing on the past and focus on the future. Let bygones be bygones. But I feel like this. we have somebody here that is so angry that they can't let bygones be bygones. And, you know, things get worse because they can't. It's time to heal. It is. It's a time to heal with the Five of Cups reversed. It's time to accept. It's time to accept a loss. But we got somebody here that is having a very hard time accepting a loss. And they're reacting. So be prepared to deal with somebody that is reacting from their pain. One more card. Queen of Swords. Now, the Queen of Swords, we know who she is. She is really not one to mess with. Okay, the Queen of Swords is very forthright. She's very authentic. She's very truthful. She's very to the point. She's a protector. She is a professional. She is brash and she has to think fast. Somebody may need to think fast and they may need to uh, think outside the box. Okay, uh, looks like she has the truth, she has the power in her hands, she has the sword of truth. So this queen of swords is very powerful. 
she has some sort of opportunity in her hands. She's going to be making a decision. I feel like somebody is going to be coming towards her. She may not want to communicate. She because it feels like her back is turned. She may she she's very intimidating. So somebody may be intimidated by this Queen of Swords. She's it feels like she has a weapon in her hands. She, you know, she has a truth. I feel like this Queen of Swords is going to have to think fast. She's going to have to react to somebody's choice, okay? Because there's a choice that is being, she's going to have to make a choice. She's going to have to make a spur of the moment decision. Somebody may be returning. This person may be showing up. She may be making a call. This person may be making a call. May need to call somebody, you know, for help. I'm just being honest. Anyhow, I think that... Uh, You're going to need to be open to listening. You're going to be need you're going to need to be open to look at looking at things from another perspective. You may be dealing with somebody today that is reacting from a painful experience that they endured which was some sort of loss that really impacted them. Maybe this person just needs you to listen. You know, they just need to get their pain out, whatever. Maybe you need to block them. Maybe you need to just, you know, protect your energy, you know, and, and block this person. I understand that, you know, people like this need help. But if they're taking their pain out on you, do you deserve that? So you're going to have to make a judgment call by the looks of things. And I don't need the judgment call, the judgment card. Somebody's going to have to be making a spur of the moment decision based on, I feel like we have somebody here that is, I don't know, feels like they're dying. Okay. I, I mean, the t I mean, I, I hate to say those words, but that's what it looks like to me. And, and, and time matters. It feels like timing matters. Okay. Um, Anyhow, I mean, that Ace of Pentacles reverse is a loss. It's a huge loss. It's a big loss. It's a loss of stability. It's unplanned. It's unplanned. It's an unplanned loss. I'm sorry. Goodbye. Good luck.